pedal to the metal. Yeah, hardcore. This, this match could melt steel beams. I can see this match ending in my five minutes. Yeah. Count it on the YouTube video right now afterwards. It's gonna be a five minute video. I'm calling it now. Let's go. So right off the bat, you saw Nick land that down air. Mr. Reed was at 0%, so he's able to just respond with an up air up tilt afterwards. A lot of the time, Nixie's gonna be trying to like dash around his opponent. Bait out options. He his entire game plan is to make Mr. E feel unsafe and push a button and wait for that neutral air one ladies and gentlemen exclamation point you know what's the type All right down tilt catches the dash attack now even though mystery has a sword and Nixie is gonna have to respect it the second like he uh, mystery goes for that swing Nixie can easily get a punish right afterwards. Respecting the forward tilt, doesn't want to go for the punish afterwards. Waits for him to swing out a second one before go closing the gap. And I feel like every single time that Nixie's been trying to like get some follow-up action against Mystery, that's like the fourth time I've seen Mystery just swat him out of the air with a forward air. It could be some uh, conditioning later on. Finally gets the down air into knee conversion that he's been looking for one stock away in this first one minute game. Hey, gentlemen, I'm off stage. Less than a minute and a half. Oh my yeah, God. I'm tell. I told you, like I'm not shocked. 45 second stocks. Good lord. Collide. I mean, I honestly, if I had Captain Falcon's fist, I'd collide with a sword too. You know. Back here. It was nice. Okay, <laughs> Nixie looking for a reset. Falcon kicks the completely wrong direction, gets back onto the stage by holding down to give him a little, little love. Runs up, punishes the forward smash. Sees him drifting with his opponent down below. He waits for the landing. Mystery opting to land to the right to avoid any sort of follow-ups. Nixie, hungry for this downer. And honestly, I mean, he's got it once before, so wants to try to make a... Uh, History repeat itself, but just like that, his stocks are trying to drop two. One down air away, one first swing of neutral air away, taking home this first game. But let's see if Mystery's even gonna give him the opportunity. Two higher percent for the up air to connect. Gets for the goes for the Falcon kick off of the first swing of neutral air. I respect the decision. Whips the back air, shield breaker pushes him off. That forward air would have been deadly if he got that to connect. Downer pushes up high into the air, not enough to get the kill just yet. 166% on Mr. E. Oh my god. What? He's alive! Dude, you like snatched him from like That was incredible. Did you say that replay? I want to watch it. Anyways, 175. Shield breaker catches him out of shield. Forward smash and Mr. E snatches wow. victory away from Nick in that game one. Nick was up three stocks to one. I won. I'm shocked too, Lucina. Here's where like he like. Let's watch this exchange. That was so. That funky. was so crazy. You watch it in slow mo. Hold on. Yeah, I got you. Cause like 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 he like sw he mystery like clearly swung from like, uh, my, like, wow, wow, that's like he forward smashed. Nuts. That's actually in crazy. the middle of forward smash. Like she even leaned back. Wow. Oh my god, that's okay. So he kind of grabbed her hand. You saw it? Yeah, he grabbed her hand. Like, he definitely before grabbed the, her before hand. the sword came down. Yeah, that's still so nuts. Lucky for Mr. E, great DI coming out from him. Wasn't able to die from it. Honestly, it's hard to say great DI against when it does like the slow mo victory because it's like, okay, if you don't DI that correctly, like what are you doing? Yeah. During that, like that, those two seconds. How do you Is like? Is he out of jumps? No, there he is. How do you lose the game where like two forty-five second stocks? Yo, know, E with the comeback, OD. Smash is crazy, dude. Yeah. Dash attack. Down oh. smash catches the landing. That's a classic Nick as well. He'll he'll go for down smash a lot to cover like landing options. Really good at catching. So you don't have to guess which side they're gonna land on. Yeah, he also went with the late hit of it to make sure that like if it missed, it'd be safe. Right. Oh, sorry. Right. He opposite to start the down smash before they even touch the ground. Okay, respects the dolphin slash. Uh, because of the way Dolphin Slash works, if you're just standing on the ledge like that, you'll get caught by it. So you'll notice a lot of the times Nixie has to like, get away in some fashion, either jumping away or opting to go for that down air afterwards. Catches him jumping with an anti-air up tilt. Knee. 
Oh, soft hit me again. Too high a percent. Try to go for down smash yet again, pairing out that neutral air. Sends him flying off stage. Ate the double jump. Had to get back on the stage as fast as possible. He had the fastest recovery with the up B. 146. And trying to bait out when he's going to go for the dolphin slash. Mystery has to mix up his timing. Able to do so. Nice grab. Back throw. Not enough to get the kill just yet. Mystery had that uh, DI add unlock. You see playing patient. Trying to just catch him with a very safe, extremely safe neutral air. What was that side B? Shut up, Nick. Like, what would he get off of that? He was at zero. 8% on me. And throwing a lot of downers. Good tech chase from Mr. E. He's out of jumps. Great opportunity. Whiffs the forward smash. A, a hair too slow. Uh, I think... I think Nick sweet spotted it, so he actually like spaced it this time. It's like not not again. Not happening. Yeah. Although I don't know how low uh, the F smash hits. I'm pretty sure you can two frame with it. I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah. I mean that's how it worked in Smash 4. Hey, Dolphin slash. Those are the back here at his shield just in case you know Nick wanted to go for a jump. Hair too far away. Catching that forward smash before he's drifting again with the opponent. Catches the Falcon dive this time around. Connects the forward arrow. We're seeing kind of a repeat from the previous game. We've seen the situation again where they're on the final socks and Mr. E's at high percent. Can he do the turnaround? This would be a huge upset for Mr. E to take out Nick C in winner's semis and move on to winner's finals himself. Good patience from Nick. Dash dancing to bait it out. Honestly, at this point, Nick gets one more grab. That's going to be death on Mr. E. Or just the gentleman's. I mean, it's not its not the knee of justice that we all know and love, but it's definitely a form of a knee. Yeah, it's definitely a knee. Nixie taking away game number two. The turning is in. And honestly, I feel like in Nixie's mind, he's like, that should have been the set because of that ba that first back throw oh, in game yeah. one. All right, so he's getting rid of the, the triplets. Yeah, I get that. But I, from what I've been reading in the chat, I think he's gonna pick Smash. Yeah, I'm yeah. not surprised. Apparently, this is a really good stage for Marth. Apparently, Fire Emblem on Smashville. Yeah, it's good. Fire em uh, Smashville and Battlefield. Okay. He's hesitating. He's oh yeah, going for Lucy. You think he would have maybe picked Marth? I mean, if he's hesitating, like who else would he have picked? Honestly, I feel like Marth would. I mean, I, I agree with the Lucina pick. Yeah. But I wouldn't, I wouldn't be shocked if he went for Marth, and I wouldn't disagree with his Marth pick. But I'm happy he stuck with Luciana. Stuck to his guns. You know, he just keeps jumping around in the camera. It's really funny. Yeah. That's my favorite thing about Mystery. Yeah. He's just a very animated player. You got two things to watch. He feels the forward smash. When he, like, oh, jumps yeah. in his seat when he lands a forward smash, that's Definitely. how you know he's playing on fire. That's how you know he has momentum. Definitely. And right now, speaking of momentum, he's already carried Nick to 108%. Smashville, a beautiful pick for Mystery. Okay, free punish for E. Just gonna get some free damage off of that. Nothing too crazy. Sets him up too high a percent to get that follow up. There we go, Mystery finally taking the first stock away from Nick. Like trying to respond with the knee of himself. A little bit of a conversion. Can, like, just stuffs out the Falcon kick. Going off super deep for the forward air. Trying to look for this down tilt. Nixie lands that down tilt. Put Lucina at such an awkward angle that it might be tougher to recover. Get some down tilts coming out. Good patience, but Nixie was able to touch back down to the ground and recover his jump. No stage spike happening today. Whittling down that shield, though, this is the time where Mystery can play aggressive as hell. That's why, actually, he went for a down tilt right there, because there's no way for him to shield it. But he just goes for the Falcon Kick, gets the kill off of down B, take this to a two-stock two situation. Stop tilt. Because when your opponent's shield is, like, that small off of a shield breaker, down tilt's a solid option, because it'll be a free shield mode. It's also one of Lucina's safest moves on the ground. Safer than Jam, I believe. Trying to get the forward smash again, up there instead. Looking for one more back here. Goes for the 
spot dodge to avoid the grab. Get connects yet one more back air. Mystery one stock away from moving on to winner's finals. That's right, face off against Jewel. Have ourselves a Fire Emblem Awakening finals, you know? Back air. Oh, God. He Honestly, Nick had to go for something crazy like that. He needs some sort of, like, shift in his favor, you know? Went off deep. Oh, Mystery went too low. He got scared. He thought Nick was going to go for the down air. It's too intense. And now, Mystery bringing it back. Makes him use a double jump. Gets it back. Oh. Not this time. That, that was a good side beat coming out from Nixie. Mixing up his recovery to get back onto the stage. Mystery's chilling. He's oh, just wow. swinging like crazy, and Nick doesn't really have an answer for the sword. Yeah, stage is too small. 113%. Mr. E wants the neutral air. Right. Can't land it. The only thing that can happen now is silly Falcon things. And honestly, oh, no. it's starting to happen. Oh, it's starting to happen, Devin. He's up at 49% off of these up airs. Right. Trying to catch him with the neutral air. Mystery's going to stay grounded on the stage. It's not going to chase after him. Oh. Doesn't want to risk his lead. He's got that shield will get super small. Mystery can play aggressive. Down tilt. He's going to come out a lot. Down air out of shield. Great option. 147% up air. Has him flying in the skies. Catches the Falcon kick and gets the kill. Upsetting Nixie. Sending him to losers. Mystery is moving wow. on to winner's finals. That was actually crazy. Dude, he like did the down. Uh, he like barely dodged the down air. I think it was that here. was down B dog. Oh, that was down there. You're right. Boom. I missed it. Yeah. It was actually, too no. Things okay. were happening way too fast. He like he. All right. He dodged it by actually like running off the platform. Okay. Yeah. Oh my. Yeah, yeah. That was actually pretty good. That was a safe option to go yeah. for. Honestly, you want to you you want to run off the platform to throw mm -hmm. out an aerial attack. Yeah. Because then you because like, if you whiff then whatever you're back down on the ground. So. Yeah. He just, it was just a safe option. I'm not even sure if Mystery wanted to even connect the up air. It might have just been like a whole, I'm going to throw this yeah, out there just, while I'm landing. Just stage control. Might as well. Yeah, exactly. It, but it ended up getting the kill because Nixie didn't respect it. He tried to fast fall with that downer. So mm -hmm. Nixie moving on to losers quarters. Yeah.